might have seen this super creepy video on your social media feeds of a snake just cruising along in Lake Pleasant. Here's a snapshot of it. The Arizona Game and Fish Department says not only do snakes swim, but as you see, they're pretty good at it as well. Here's CBS 5's Amanda Goodman with what to look out for this weekend. It is an admittedly trippy sight. Check that out. It's a rattler. Snakes yep. slithering along the surface of Arizona lakes and rivers. Wouldn't want to step on that, dude. Recording the rattlesnake that swum up by us. The reptiles, though, like this one spotted at Lake Pleasant, are quite at ease in the water. Some even prefer it. Some snakes are aquatic, like garter snakes. Others, like rattlesnakes, just occasionally will get in the water. But there are many varieties, many species in Arizona that will go into the water. We often see snakes along the edge. Of the Mike water. Demlong is with Arizona Game and Fish. He says non-aquatic snakes will take a dip for any number of reasons. It could be escaping a predator. It could be looking for a mate. It could be going to new habitat. It could be just out cooling itself off when it's 100 degrees out. Now that it's warmer, there's a chance you can encounter one of these fellas anywhere in the state. So swimming snakes, not that uncommon in Arizona, but Game and Fish says capturing them on video is. So if you do come across one in action on the water, they say take a moment and enjoy it. It's just kind of a lucky moment. That's the day you buy a lottery ticket if you get to see a snake in the water. Demlong stresses that snakes in our waterways don't pose any real threat as long as you leave them alone. The department's not worried about rattlesnakes in the water. What we're worried about is people not wearing their flotation devices when they're in the water or drinking or doing things they shouldn't do in the water. Those, that's where the risk is. In Phoenix, Amanda Goodman, CBS 5 News.